She's got a bag. I want that bag she's got. She's got a paper bag with medicine in it. I want y'all to see that. God is a good way is the bag in. Go get it, Paul. Let you know what the Lord is. Oh, why don't y'all give God another praise, Paul? the woman that testified. How many listen to the broadcast? All oh, this medicine. Isn't that something? Who'll let your hand? Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Why don't y'all give God a praise for it? Tell me, in your words, what each one of those, what did you do with those? I want you to listen and show you how people are spending money. The doctor said she'd have to do this the rest of her life. Hallelujah. Amen. Talk loud, now what do you need? This is for high blood pressure. I take what, two of these a day. You take two of them a day for high blood pressure. Yes. What else did you take? I had to take a sleeping pill every night before I went to bed. I you couldn't, couldn't get any sleep. sleep. At night. No, I couldn't get any sleep without my sleeping pill. This was pain medications that I had to take for pains. No. This is for when I had pains in my, my heart, my chest. I went to put a pill on my tongue to let it dissolve. Yeah, no. These are hard medication twice a day. Wait a minute now, you mean you take these twice a day? Yes. All of these? Yes. Now what is those you had? These is for strep. I couldn't, when I was sitting in my living room, I was so weak before I could get to my kitchen that I had to stop at the kitchen table to get strength to make it farther. And when you wake up in the morning, what did you have to do? I had to take two of these uh, nerve pills when I first get up in the morning time to get my husband off to work and my children off to school. I had to take two of these in the morning when I first got up, one at 12 o'clock and one at 4 o'clock. And you had to do this every day? Yes, it was every day. Until yesterday was three weeks ago when the Lord really healed my body. And I haven't had any medication since then. Those pills have been on my shelf ever since. You haven't taken another one? No, I haven't. In three weeks? No, I haven't. How you been feeling? I felt fine. How you feel now? I feel fine. I feel <laughs> wonderful. Why don't y'all pray? <laughs> The doctor said you'd have to take these the rest of your life? Yes, I have went to several doctors, and each one told me I had to take one, uh, two or three pills for the balance of my life. But this is a strong medication for high blood pressure. I have taken several different kinds that wasn't strong enough. My blood pressure stayed at the rate of 230. I have worked at my blood pressure 230 until my doctor stopped me from work. Y'all know this is God. How did you know about the meeting here? I, I've listened to you over the radio and I've had lots of friends have visited the meeting and they would all tell me about it. But I just decided within myself, this was the place for me to come. It seemed like I felt that if I could have got inside the building, I felt that the Lord would heal me. You know he what I mean? did now, just you mean that. To tell me 
she gonna say nothing. Nobody have to pray for her. If she just get inside the bed, you'd be healed. Yes, I felt that way. And I was healed. See, like when I walked in the bill, and see, like I began to just loosen up. See, like something just, you know, when you wind up real tight, you see, like you're something that was just loose. And I, was, I just began to feel better and better. And see, like I, I was just, I was just wonderful, amazing. You know, I knew the Lord could do it, but you know, kind of, you know, you have kind of a doubt every now and then. But it seemed like this wasn't any doubt at all. I just felt if the Lord just blessed me to get inside the building. When I got here, it was only three people here, and it was no service going on. The Lord did just that. It, well, the nice did pray for me either. But you know the Lord did just that because the power of the Lord was in this building. And I thank and praise the God for that. Somebody here said it's just like Jesus. Tell him that just like Jesus. He's all right. How many know he's all right? Now this has been how long ago? This has been this past yesterday, the Thursday was three weeks ago. And you haven't had a pill? Shoot? No, I haven't. How do you feel in your body now? I feel wonderful in my body. Can you walk? Sure, I can walk. <laughs> can you run? Yes, I can run. You said you couldn't hardly walk across your living room? I couldn't hardly walk across my living room. I was so depressed, I would just cry at home because I was so disgusted with myself. I would take all those pills, and then I began to think, now, when the Lord saved me, He didn't save me that way. When the Lord filled me, I had joy. I had peace. I could dance. I could, you know, I could shout. But I had gotten to the place I was just in the house. I was just there. I didn't even want to go in the place. I was really disgusted. Have you I was been, really, since you've been healed? Oh, yes, I have. <laughs> You feel all right? Yes, I feel wonderful. Let me see you run down that aisle right quick. Give my praise that she go right